Welcome back, students. It's awesome to see you guys, and gosh, it's, it's, it's a great opportunity to come out here, maybe get some new gear, and it's awesome to see you all here today. Justin, what advice would you have for the kids who have a dream, whether it's to play football or basketball or be a lawyer or a doctor? Keep working hard. Whatever you guys want to do, you're able to do it. And if you work hard, you put the work in, you listen to your parents, you listen to your teachers, you make sure to, to clean your rooms and do all that stuff that your parents ask of you, I think you guys are able to do anything you guys want to do. We just appreciate the Chargers taking the time, Justin taking his time. You know, it was touching to see someone that cares about the community. I know he's new to our community, but it makes a big difference. These kids look for people that are successful and they want to emulate those kind of people. I remember growing up and, and seeing all these players come through and, and the impact they had on me. And so if I could have any of the slightest bit of impact like that, I, I think that's a mission accomplished. So it's, it's been a lot of fun. Every day I probably tell myself to work as hard as I can. If I work hard in school, at football, practice, whatever it is, I can go to bed at night feeling proud of myself. What's your favorite color in the football team? My favorite color on our football team would have to be the blue. Well, who's the to play with? Oof, that's a tough question. Um, I probably wouldn't be able to play defense too well, but uh, if I had to play a position, I'd probably say safety. We're just week three into our students being back here in person. It means the world for them to uh, see someone who inspires them and really just get to get back to some sense of normalcy. Ooh, I like the I like the sign. <laughs> our kids will be talking about this for the rest of the year, so we're super appreciative of all of the donations and the time and energy. Our students will never forget this day.